go, go, Power Rangers! This isn't Power Rangers. This is Resident Evil. I'm I'm Chris Redfield. Go, go, Chris Red Ranger Field. <laughs> Chris would be the Red Ranger. <laughs> I can actually see it. Chris would be the Red Ranger. I'm he not huge the, into the whole Power the Rangers, Ranger. mainly because my mom wouldn't let me watch it when I was a kid. Even though it was designed specifically for kids. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, my mom my mom wouldn't let me watch Power Rangers. She said it was too violent. It's alright, we could watch Ninja Turtles then. Krista Brad, can you hear me? Brad! Oh. Damn! We <sighs> have to give Brad a sign. We have to give Brad... A headache. Well, how are we gonna give him a headache? He can't hear we're gonna, us. We're gonna find him, and we're gonna put a hundred cats in his bedroom, and force him to sleep in it. <laughs> and he's gonna get a terrible sinus headache. I mean, I'm allergic to cats, so that would work on me. I'm allergic to cats, too, despite having two of them. I mean, I, I feel ya. I love cats. I don't, I don't care if I'm allergic to them, I'll, I'll suffer through the pain. I suffered through the pain. You still Speaking suffer of, through the pain. Speaking of one, well, one, of, one of them's sitting here, actually. Also, there is a, there's a doggo. There used to be crows, but now there's doggos. Oh, I don't also, like the snakes doggos. are back. The, the so snakes, much. I got bit. I'm gonna die. Oh, oh no. I'm poisoned. Are you, are you going... I'm poisoned. Actually, no, I'm fine. Are you are you throwing up? No, no, I I didn't actually get poisoned. <laughs> what kind of poison do you think it is? Like, do you think it's like stomach poisoning? No, think I think it's, it's like, like uh, hemotoxin. Oh, okay. I don't think it's a neurotoxin. Usually, venom is not like that, or snake venom. But I have I been some... wrong before. Are you gonna eat some food? Uh, I'm gonna slap this dog away from my hand. It was not you... not kind. We'll give him some food, goo and then he'll. Uh, uh... Well, I don't know if that's gonna work. He's zombified. T virus doggo. Imagine if he ate bad food, and it just blew up in his head. Psst. He would be an unhappy camper. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna use some of that, because I can. In fact, I'm gonna do it twice, just, just for good measure. I'm gonna use it once, because I like to live dangerously. Oh, that, that's fantastic. I should mention Chaz, my friend. Mm -hmm. I'm so sorry we had a failed part. It's okay. See, what happened was we were having technical difficulties while recording this, and then I somehow unplugged my mic. It's easy to do. And uh, apparently my audio... Uh, my audio software, the thing that I'm using to record my audio, it just was like, yeah, you're, you're no longer able to record what's coming off of my end. It recorded chess just fine, but... I would be talking to no one. Yeah. Um, also, we got some items. We got a note. It's from Wesker, by the way. Also, he fixed Albie. the doorknob. Thanks, Albie. And it's Wesker. Well, I know I went by that really quick, but it said Wesker. Thanks, See, Albie. Wesker's a nice guy. Imagine if his name was... What if he was just the like, nicest dude in the world and didn't want... You know what's funny? His name is Albert Wesker. Yeah. You want to know who else's first name is Albert? Um, Prince Albert? No. I mean, like, from a Capcom game, oddly enough. I'm trying to think. Would I know Do I know him? Yeah. Albert. Dr. Wiley? Wiley. That's his name, Wiley? The Albert Wiley. Dr. Dude. Albert Wiley. What's Dr. Light's first name? I don't remember. Hmm. Oh, Chaz. Do you, do you like spooky stuff? I I like spooky spookies. Okay, well it's... get ready for the spooks of your life. 
That's me. Oh man. Booga booga. <laughs> that was me. That, Don't that's you. Me. That's me. Don't Th shoot me. Well, you're you're dead. No, I'm not. You're, you're you're on the floor dead. No, I'm not. You're you're also a hunter, Chaz. Yes. Why why are you a hunter? I uh I ate some bad sushi. And oh, did did you eat the fugu? The... Is this is this what happens when you eat the fugu? No, the sushi had a uh, T virus cells in it. Oh. I should explain something. Um, I kept my shotgun because, well, we were introduced to hunters. Uh, fun fact about when they introduce you to hunters, because you gotta go back to the mansion. Uh, hunters now lurk the halls. They patrol. Yeah. Yeah, so you'll revisit. Uh, don't worry about Crimson Heads now, because it's all about those hunters. Case the point, there's one you. around the corner. They kill you faster than you could say. They they do Skip they do have an instant kill attack. I'm not even lying about that. I will tell you this about hunters. Got hunters. Em. Hunters. They are everywhere, and they will say, "Hey, I'm gonna be here, even though you thought you were cool, but you're not cool anymore because I'm here." They could be anywhere. They could be you. They could be me. Well, you they are one. You already you already explained you're a hunter. You had bad I sushi. I lied. <laughs> I, that was a that was a story for the all the to impress all the boys and girls. Oh. Uh, I th I think I betrayed them. No. It, it's okay. No no one blames you. Well, the hunters do. They I they're like what? What you, you gonna use your I like this? gonna use our likeness for clout wow <laughs> clout wow that, that is a fun word i feel like we need to bring that more into into the let's play <laughs> wow mister um i i don't i don't think that's gonna fly hey eh? let me think oh oh chess yeah you know i just realized what happened i, I can store my shotgun you can also get your pistol ammo. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh, but I the am pistol gonna... ammo that people don't know about yet. Yeah, because <laughs> failed recording. Uh, wait, wait, wait to break the immersion, buddy. <laughs> it's okay. I, it, it doesn't matter. I, I already explained it, so it's not like you're spoiling that much. I mean, we're gonna do it in like. Five They're seconds. gonna wonder what I'm talking about. Oh, pistol ammo. Oh, there's some special pistol ammo. No, yes. No, 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 there's no, special no. pistol. Everybody, there's special pistol ammo. There, there's no special up. pistol ammo. They were called 3.5 hollow point. That, pistol that those aren't in this game though. You use them on your broken bug fly. <laughs> now you're just getting everyone's hopes up that there's gonna be something amazing around the corner when clearly there's not. Listen to me. I know what I'm talking. Um, I, I believe you. I I I completely trust everything you're talking about. I've played all the Resident Evil games. I have played Resident but Evil Code Veronica. I've played Resident Evil Seven. I've played Resident Evil Nineteen. That doesn't even exist yet. You don't know that. Well, I mean, the only way I see that happening is one Capcom somehow manages to survive that long which you know i'm i'm gonna say is a possibility two if they did go out of business someone would have to like i don't know they'd have to sell the properties or something and so someone would have to take up the mantle i played resident evil gaiden gaiden that that was the game boy game yes i've played that one this this I, uh this puzzle I, sucks I, by the way i i didn't beat that game that's not an easy game. I I beat Resident Evil 7. That's the one where you go to Africa, right? That's 5. <laughs> 7. I don't know what 7, seven. was the new <laughs> one where it's all first person. 
<laughs> oh, the one. Uh, no, I didn't. That's uh, I think in Louisiana. Oh, I didn't play that. It's one. it's in the south. I I I make it a uh, point not to play games that take place in the south. <laughs> But it's the best. It, it totally has a Hills Have Eyes vibe. That's, you know that's a bloody lie. I play Left 4 Dead 2 a lot, and that takes place in the South. Yeah, it does. Did, did played, you play uh... as Cletus? No. Oh. Ellis. Uh, you either play as... I play as Coach. Co yeah, actually, Coach is the best. One Man Cheeseburger Apocalypse. Eagle of the South, the... Wolf of the North. See, Eagle of the South, Wolf of the North. Now, this Wolf of the North is um, Ken Shiro. Yeah, I was going to say Wolf of the North Star. He goes... Oh! Actually, he goes... Omae wa mo shindayu. <laughs> Nani? <laughs> then he, he... At, 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 at... Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, oh, uh, uh. <laughs> what we just missed was uh, you open the book and you got the eagle medallion. Well, thing. they saw that. Um, also, we got we got Trevor's diary. This is there. There's Uncle no Trevor. indication of this, by the way. I, I'm only reading it because you can kind you can make out words. Yeah, it says it at the bottom left. Yeah, there. and and also I see how did I end up like this? This isn't actually in the, this isn't actually in the text we're gonna read. It's just at the bottom. Yeah. Um. Chaz, yeah, he, do you want to do it or should I? You're Trevor. Okay, I'll I'll, I'll be Trevor. You're Trevor from Grand Theft Auto Five. <laughs> I don't I don't see I don't even know how to do a good Trevor impersonation. You just curse and kill people. I fucking can't get out of here! I tried every possible fucking way to escape! <laughs> Imagine if that's how this Trevor spoke. Uh, but the only- but only to be faced with the reality, I'm trapped. I've been everywhere. The laboratory, with large glass tubes filled with formaldehyde. I think I'm pronouncing that right. Yes, that sounds. It, it's a very, it's a very long word, and uh, I have trouble with those. And those dark, wet, and eerie caves. What can I do? It's actually a pretty common question I say to myself whenever I have to go to the bathroom. <laughs> At first, I didn't want to believe my eyes, but that familiar, high-heeled shoe in the corridor, it was like reflex. One name came to my mind, Jessica. Jessica. I don't, yeah, Jessica Jones, the superhero. Who? Marvel. Well, don't know. DC. Superman, uh, Spider-Man, um, make a man. I don't want to believe they share the same fate as me. No, I can't give up hope. I have to hope they're alive. I hope they are alive too. Uh, do you really want to open that can of worms? Because I can tell you. Yes. Oh, okay. Um, uh, in a second, because we got a lot of exploration. I haven't had anything to eat or drink for the past few days. I feel like I'm going crazy. Why is this happening to me? Why do I have to die like this? Was I too obsessed with designing this ghastly mansion? I should have known better. So, if anyone's curious, uh, George Trevor, that's what the G stands for. He He's the architect of the mansion. He designed it. So everything that we've been exploring is all a part of his design. It's all part of his work. He was hired by Umbrella, namely Oswald E. Spencer, I believe. Yes, Mr. Spencer. Yeah, Mr. Spencer. He actually gets introduced in Resident Evil 5. But he's mentioned throughout the series here and there. It was a dark and damp underground tunnel. 
and another dead end. But even in the darkness, something caught my eye. Carefully, I lit the last match I had to see what it was. A grave! <gasps> but deeply engraved into the stone was my name. George Trevor. What? At that How? instant, it all... How could it have his name? It's a... Uh... It's, um... There's a term for this. It's not foreshadowing, but... I don't know. Ba basically, they, they're just telling him he's gonna die here. What if I didn't die there? Um, it all became clear to me. Those bastards knew from the beginning that I'd die here. And I fell right into their trap. So, that that's how. It's too late now. I'm losing it. Everything is becoming so far away. Jessica, Lisa, forgive me. Lisa, well, she goes on to meet another guy named Brad. Well, that's a different game entirely. <laughs> Uh, because of my ego, I got both of you involved in this whole damn conspiracy. Forgive me. May God justify my death in exchange for your safety. George Trevor. They're not safe. You want to know what happens to Jessica? She turns into puffy, puppy chow. No, she dies. Oh. You want to know what happens to Lisa? She gets turned into puppy chow. No, she, we've actually seen her. Oh, yeah, we have. She's in the, She's the, the monster in chains. Oh, she's Alice in Chains. Yeah, yeah, totally. She's, uh... She's not fun to encounter. She's not fun to fight. She's not fun to do anything with. She also says... Uh, she also has... Basic comprehension of stuff, but yeah. Not, not fun. And... Oh, I want that. Let's see here. I want my map button so I can see that I am actually in the clear. Okie dokie. Oh, there's a spider. Ever tell you spiders are easy to get oh, around? Run. Yeah, you can actually move them out of the way. It's kind of... It's kind of easy, to be honest. Oh, man. Well, you have what I need. I have what you need, too. Yeah. You say he's just a friend. You say he's just a friend. Oh, oh baby. Oh, I got a crit. That was amazing. Okay, I gotta think carefully how I'm gonna do this next because, um, you see, there's stuff, and I need stuff. I like stuff. I don't know about you, maybe you like stuff. Also, um, yeah. turning that on activates the elevator. Okay, let's see. I want that red herb, and I want that blue herb, and I have no space, and in order to do anything, I have to actually waste an herb. Or I have to waste my mixture. I'll, I'll make a... I'll give you another one. This this is what sucks about Chris. His inventory, his item management is not great. It's extremely limited. Hmm. Huh. I'm looking and I'm thinking and I'm like mm, can't do anything about that nah it's not worth it as much as I wish it was it's not worth it now remember the kitchen I do welcome back to the kitchen welcome back to the zombies I was cooking some uh, charcuterie in here. Charcuterie. Mm -hmm. We don't really cook charcuterie. I can hear it. Oh, tried to grab me. Oh, that one tried to grab me too. They're little ankle biters.
think it took care of them. Not like it's gonna matter in the long run of things. You wanna cook something? You want me to cook you something? Uh, yeah. Make, make me a Kobe beef burger. I don't have Kobe beef. Yeah, it's expensive. I'd be surprised if he did, to be honest. I don't, I don't, I don't keep that kind of stuff. <laughs> well, it's expensive. Man, oh man. I'm trying to... There's another type of, um... Oh, did I get a crit? Did I... I crit him. I don't need to burn the body, because I got a crit. What was I going to say? There's another type of beef that's really good, and I can't remember what it's called. But my coworker was telling me he got some, and I was thinking, damn, son, what I would give to be in your shoes when you tried that. And I can't remember what it's called. I but... wonder if it's... I mean, it would be wasted on me, Kobe beef. Kobe because beef? I don't... Yeah, I wouldn't... I would... I wouldn't like it. Well, we don't know that, but I'll tell you what, I have to cut the part real quick. Okay, cut it, cut it. Well, I mean, I have to cut it only because, oh. you see, my inventory is so full and I want... Well, you see that thing on the table? I see. It's crucial I get that. Oh, yeah, it's going... Yeah, alright. Um, so, well, I'm just... just pause... Pause the video, guys. Pause it right now. Press the pause button. Get yourself a Slurpee. And we'll be right back. I cleared out some inventory, and now I'm going to pick this stuff up. Mm. I was going to cut it and, like, come back here, and then I realized I don't need to do that. Mm. My inventory does look a little different. It's because I basically got everything that I missed out on collecting while Wait. I had a chance. But the main thing I want to know is I got that battery. And we're getting out of here. Because there's actually nothing left to do here on this floor. Now, Chaz, there was a type of beef I was trying to remember. It wasn't Kobe beef, although... Uh, although that comes from Japan, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, Japanese cows. Yeah, there's actually another type of beef that I was having trouble remembering, but I had you look it up, and I also remembered it, because I have this odd... I have this odd, like, hindsight or insight that comes to me whenever I'm, like, not recording, or I have to pause, pause it, and it just seems to come back, and it's like, Wagyu beef. Yeah. Which is also really expensive and comes from Japan, but it's supposedly really good. And my coworker had, he like, found some of that on special. Yes. Uh, because it was like, it was near the sell-by date. Oh. Which so, is how, yeah. how he got it for such a good deal. Right. That's, that is what he tells me. He can, uh, sometimes get, um... He'll sometimes go to, like, the grocery store and he'll find, like, you know, the the near, near sale by date. So it's, like, heavily discounted. But, yeah, he just, he just, um, he gets it and he makes out pretty well by doing that. I am, uh, looking at prices for Wagyu beef. It's expensive. Yes, it is. Now, how much would you pay for a Wagyu flank steak? I think it was telling me on average it's like... Uh, what was it? Like $20, $30 a pound? I wonder how many pounds this thing is. I don't know, but my point is he got it He got it for like, you know... A discount? He got it, well yes. one, since it was near the sell-by date. I think he paid like, uh... I think he got like, you know, um... Like, 75% off on it? That's pretty crazy. Yeah, so what would have been, like, you know, this... Uh, what would have been, like, $50 or so... Is now, like, significantly lower in cost. Well... 
this flank steak I'm looking at, it is um, one and a half pounds, about. And it is $79. Yep, that sounds about right. So, you said $20 a pound? Well, I don't know if it's a pound. Maybe it's per ounce. Probably an ounce, because $20 a pound would be $40. Yeah. Unless this site is like... No, no, off. I think the site's quite accurate. I'm trying to rem I, I don't remember the specifics myself. Right, I should explain how this works. Uh, so there's actually stuff in the eye sockets of these heads, these mounted heads. Yeah. And the eagle follows me where I go. Now the reason I bring this up is you actually can see there's a highlighted thing. Now if it's blinking, it's locked into place. I can't grab it. And it's all depending on where the eagle is looking. Yeah. So in order to actually get what you want from each eye hole, you basically have to just trick out the eagle like so and then be quick and you, you get the jewel from the eye like so. That one in particular, the one that I just got, is going to the tiger. There's actually another one that, well, we haven't even had to deal with that yet. We will. It's actually what confused me with getting the death mask. But we'll, uh, we'll address that when the time comes. That was that. Excellent. Yes. And I have room. Let's see. And... I didn't collect everything. There's actually something... St oh! You know what I forgot to do? What did you forget to do? There's a memo. Oh, yeah. I forgot about this. Chess, do you wanna... you wanna do the honors? I will read it, because I read it last time. <laughs> oh, also. Priority procedures from Umbrella Headquarters. Yes. Mail headquarters is... That doesn't look right. That looks like a typo. A typo. Headquarters. <laughs> <laughs> what happened that day? Well... Hmm. Is it confidential? Uh, we're not allowed to read this... For you. It, it's okay. We got the executive pass. Attention... Chief of Security, date July 22nd, 1998, 2.13 a.m. or p.m.? We, we don't, don't know. know. X day is drawing upon us. Execute the following procedures within one week. Prompt actions are demanded. Number one, lure stars to a state. And obtained bow raw combat data against stars. Uh, so I, I'm not a hundred percent certain what the acronym for STARS is. It's a special task, something, R us. <laughs> uh, I mean I can look this up while you read it, but um, B O W stands for bio, organic weapon, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, okay. Number two. Collect two embryos of each mutated specimen as samples, excluding the tyrant. Dispose of the tyrant. Number three. Ensure complete disposal of all Archelae laboratory, including all personnel and test animals. Disguise their deaths as an accident. When the above procedures are executed, report to headquarters for further instructions. If for some reason you are unable to execute the procedures by the deadline, report immediately. In case of emergency situations, respond directly to the extension number 5691. Good luck! Umbrella Headquarters, Umbrella Inc. And that was that. Now, I hate to do this, but my, my earbuds are about to die. Oh. I know we just had a break, but I, I gotta cut it again so I can go. <laughs> Hopefully everything is fine. Uh, BRB. Alright, sorry about that. Need to just get my other set of Bluetooth headphones because, uh, you know, being able to hear the game and everything going on and also not having it blare through the, uh, 
microphone is important. Yes. Also, I looked up what STARS stands for, the acronym. Mm -hmm. It's Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Oh. At least according to the wiki. Well, I believe the wiki. I do too. You know, it makes sense to me. When I was originally playing this on the PlayStation, and yes, I did do that, plug in for that. Um, I I remember I said something about stars. Like I I remembered most of it, but I got a couple of the letters in the acronym wrong, or I got one of the letters wrong in the acronym. So, ever since then, I've been very precautious when it comes to trying to actually properly know what what it stands for. It's important. It's very, it's so important. Oh yeah, absolutely. All right, are you are you ready for? Spookums. For, yeah, spookums. Lots and lots yes. of spookums. Because I'm there ready. he is. There's Mr. Spookums. <gasps> He's Spookums. trying to grab me. I, I'm wrestling with the camera, so I apologize if it's not as as good as it should be. I managed to avoid getting grabbed. Mm, nice. Aren't you proud of me? I'm very proud of you. Aw. Validation. It, it's what keeps me going. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> My ego is swelling. I'm so, so, so hungry for pride. <laughs> Man. This was this was the worst resuming. I should have just cut the part because literally I'm cutting it now. <laughs> I just need that little bit. I, I just I just need that little bit of validation. No, you just needed me to praise you. Yeah, you? yeah, I did. I did. I really did. Okay. Bye, everybody. Oh wait, Chess, you wanna you wanna give the last words? I, I need to I need to give you your your piece. Everybody. Because this was gone in the last part. Make sure you drink your milk for healthy, strong bones.